is it okay if I'm eating pork? Well, if you're not a Muslim, then it's okay. <laughs> Christianity doesn't have this is good and this is bad. This is okay and this is not okay. Everything is good because everything came from the good God, including the pig. Who created the pig? God. Well, this good God, how can he create something that is not good? Impossible. But when you read in the Old Testament, the third book in Torah, Leviticus chapter 11, the Lord God warned the Israelite nation of what to eat and what not to eat from as far as animals are concerned. So he was referring about the pig, one of the animals that you cannot eat its meat. Why? Because the Lord God in Leviticus 11 says, any animal that has its hoof not split, if it's one piece, the hoof, the bottom of the, of the foot, if the hoof is one piece, you do not eat from that animal. If the hoof of that animal is split, you can eat that animal. It is okay. The pig, the hoof of it is one piece. The Lord God was not talking about animals. The Holy Bible, both Old and New Testament, is one book that is the salvific book of God to the humanity. God is sending his salvational message to the human race. So when you ever, whenever you approach the Holy Bible, approach it as the salvific book of God. It is not about um, animals, geography, whatever. It is spiritual, salvific plan of God to the human race. So when God spoke about animals, spoke about trees, spoke about the birds, he was sending a profound spiritual message for our own salvation and redemption. Do not eat from the pig because the hoof is not split, it's one piece. The word eating here means do not mix. Any wisdom placed next to God's wisdom, it's nothing. God's wisdom is infinite. What wisdom can withstand this infinite being and his infinite wisdom? No one. So when God is talking, he's talking to us as if we are in at a kindergarten level. So he's going to come to me and say, Marmari, come here. Do you see the pig? Yes, Lord. Okay, I, I'm going to teach you a lesson with, through this pig. Okay. Now, do not eat, meaning do not mix. The hoof is one. The human being is made out of two main components. There is the body and there is the spirit. These are the two main components that make up the human being. But what tied them together is something called the soul, S-O-U-L. So God created the soul to tie the spirit to the body. But the main components of the human is the body and the spirit. Do not mix with someone whose hoof is one piece. Other words, body and spirit are one. God saying, do not befriend such people that you cannot differentiate between their body and their spirit. There are some people, if they sit with someone like me, they'll be spiritual. There is no one else but them. But when they sit with someone in a club, they'll be.